Hello, welcome back. The one item on the income statement that you probably have not spent a lot of time on in your accounting class are taxes. In the United States, we have what we call a progressive tax system. And what that means is that your income is taxed at a higher tax rate as the income increases. And here is a table showing the United States um, corporate tax table. So the way you read a tax table is to look at the income bracket. So what this tells us is that the first $50,000, so from zero to $50,000 is your first $50,000 is taxed at 15%. And then income that is between $50,001 and $75,000, what that means is your next $25,000 because there are $25,000 between $50,000 and $75,000. That next $25,000 is taxed at 25%. So if your company makes um, $80,000, for example, not the entire $80,000 is taxed at 34%, but rather the first $50,000 will be taxed at 15%. And the next $25,000 will be taxed at 25%. And then the remaining amount will be taxed at 34%. Uh, this concept is called the marginal tax rate. So what we, saw, what we see here, this are the marginal rate. Marginal tax rate is the tax rate that is on levy on the next dollar that you earn. So the next dollar of income will be taxed at the marginal tax rate and it is different from the average tax rate. So let's take a look at an example. So he said, let's say we make $80,000 in income. So referring back to our last table, $80,000 will fall in the marginal tax rate of 34%. But to compute our tax liability, we're going to have to divide that $80,000 into the different tax brackets we have here. So the first $50,000, so he said, that's in this tax bracket, will be taxed at 15%. And then the next $25,000, because between $51,001 and $75,000, they're $25,000, they'll be taxed at 25%. So since we have $80,000 of income, what that means is that we have um, we have accounted for $50,000, $25,000, we have, we have accounted for a total of $75,000. There are $5,000 left in this $80,000. And that last $5,000 will be taxed at 34%. And now when we multiply the income from each bracket by the marginal tax rate in, the same, in that bracket, we can f figure out what our tax liability is, and then we can add up the total. So I ask you to pause the video now and go ahead and compute the tax liability. Are these the answers you get? If you do, fantastic. If you don't get these numbers, please pause the video again and go back and check your work. So there's a good chance you just make a very simple arithmetic mistake. So now we figure out total tax liability, which is $15,450. Next, we're going to compute our average tax rate. Our average tax rate is defined as the tax divided by the taxable income. So our tax, we just computed, is $15,450 divided by our taxable income. We know our taxable income is $80,000. So that will give us an average tax rate of 0.1931 or 19.31%. Lastly, we want to look at what is the marginal tax rate. The marginal tax rate, remember, that applies to the next dollar of income. So what that means is if we earn $80,001, what tax rate would be applied to that additional $1? So we know that $80,001, that $1 will fall into this tax bracket. 
And what that means is our marginal tax rate is 34%. So to find the marginal tax rate, you have to look at the tax table. To find the average tax rate, you have to compute the tax liability and then divide the tax liability by the taxable income. So this concludes our discussion on taxes.